The National Geographic Bird app is really a neat app. I think it would be awesome to use with students, especially if you incorporated it in with perhaps your class builds their own bird feeder and then they get up to look up the different types of birds that visit with this app. It's got a lot of neat things to it. Um, you can see that it lists all of the birds by name here. You can also look at the bird families. You can look at the taxonomy, so you're teaching a lot of good vocabulary. You can also filter them by a lot of things, and one of my favorite filters for use in the classroom is by region, because you can actually filter it, like I have right now, to only include the birds that are going to be found in Nebraska, which is really fun for the students that are living. And obviously, if you're in a different state, you can choose any state to really show that. You can also choose their habitat, their month, their abundance, so you can really sort it by a lot of things. If you are looking at a bird feeder, a nice way to sort would probably be by color. If you see a black bird that you want to look at that was at your bird feeder and you're not sure what it is, you can filter it out and only see those black birds. So what I'm going to show you too is how it works when you actually look at a bird. So once you find the bird that you are quite sure you're seeing, so I'll check, pick the woodpecker, you can click on it and it will tell you all about the birds. It will show you all the, um, oops, sorry about that. It will show you all the different characteristics. You can scroll down with your finger to learn all about it. You can see learn more about its appearance, more about its behavior. Up here on the top toolbar, you can go to maps and you can see what part of the country that it is found in. And you can also go to sounds to hear what it sounds like. So when I push play, Actually get to hear what the bird sounds like in the wild. So it's just a really neat informational app that the students will really like and that can be used in a variety of different ways.